A rash of murders has Detroit police and residents on alert today. They are worried about who and where the violence will strike next. There have been at least six murders in the past 48 hours. And if things continue in this pace, the city is on track for a record murder rate this year. Frank Holland is live with more on what police and the mayor are doing to try to stop it. Frank? Well, Devin, talking about those six murders, each one of these pieces of papers you see in my hand are six releases from police in the last 48 hours of murders that have happened. Of course, the mayor and the police chief saying this rate is unacceptable, but they say it's not about the police doing more. It's about the people that live here in the city doing more. Hold it, DRA, for a current condition. Homicide on the rise in Detroit, killing spiking 20% in the first half of 2011 compared to last year. Six murders since Monday. Scenes like this all too common. A 21-year-old man gunned down at this gas station on Kerchival on the east side. We have to change the mindset and the culture of this generation. Mayor Dave Bing addressing the staggering numbers today. 172 homicides as of June 30th. The majority happening in what police call the second quarter. Again, it's a 20% increase over 2010. These numbers don't even account for this killing on Heckler Street on the west side or a 26-year-old shot in the head here at Six Mile and Woodward. Both crimes captured by local four cameras last night. The homicide issue, and it just really goes to uh, some cultural issues. Police Chief Ralph Gobby echoing the words of the mayor during a call to local four news morning, both saying the city needs its residents to take a stand with the police department. In no snitch code, I think we're making a lot of progress relative to it. Uh, however, we've got to, to leverage our or anonymous crime reporting tools like 1-800-SPEAK-UP. Too often people look at the police department and think that they're supposed to do everything. They can't do everything. Even if we had two or 3,000 additional police, some things that are happening, you're not going to stop. Now back out here live, the mayor also going on to say that it's really about this generation, the young people of the city, to try to turn things around. He was saying that, and the police chief as well, saying 1-800-SPEAK-UP, 1-800-ATF-GUNS, that people really need to take it into their own hands to call in crimes when they see them and really build a spirit of cooperation with police. And coming up at 5.30, we're going to talk about and show you a group that's doing just that, a radio patrol taking the matter into their own hands, making sure that their neighborhood is safe. Here on the west side of Detroit, Frank Holland, Local 4.